<laughs> Welcome back to Let's Play Sonic Adventure 2, episode 48. I'm your host, Ultra Director Jester. And I'm here to see Knuckles. Yep, we got our last Knuckles stage before we get into the final three stages. Oh We're no, he's done, in space. He's in and, space. Uh, yeah, we're in space, and I will say the fuck it button does work, but... Oh, cool. You see, I've added a new code. Hmm. It's a code I regret not putting in sooner. Ready? Okay. Here goes. What? Reversing gravity? Gravity control! Oh, wow! Oh, oh shit. <laughs> there, there's Whoa. two codes for gravity control. This is the simpler one of the two. Oh, wow. I, try, I tried entering the other one earlier, and it, uh, <laughs> it's like 32 <laughs> lines of code. What, what was that? Uh, there is another code yeah. that uh, has more nuanced um, gravity controls, but that's like 38 lines of code. Oh, it's my God. Yeah, forget that. But yeah, so just flick up, <laughs> flick up on the D-pad. Bam! Whoa! Like a fucking rocket, mate! Holy shit! Oh, you're going outside your own galaxy! And down we go! Oh my god! That is so cool! This should have been mad space. <laughs> no kidding! <laughs> oh, how many layers? Oh, there we go. Okay, we're back. And everything's just popping in. Oh my god, that was so cool! Uh, okay. Nobody gets as high as Knuckles. Holy shit, what are you smoking, dude? <laughs> it's like a mixture of cannabis and aspirin? What are you doing? <laughs> dude! Oh, I don't think you even need the fuck it button after that. I think you've transcended humanity. Well, I'm hitting the fuck it button, but it's not showing up. <laughs> you went too high, dude. I think I did. You, I think you I can't, despawned it. You can't fuck it anymore. No! Oh, great. Now what do we do? See, it's, it's, it's not gone. It just didn't respawn. <laughs> there we go. Oh, okay. I found him. That was close. I also said hello to Purple Rhinoceros. <laughs> yeah, this, this is stuff perfect. is great. I can smell numbers. Yeah, that was indeed an A rank. <laughs> Reaching the stratosphere, or actually farther than the stratosphere. <laughs> it was an A rank in the same way as. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> so now getting a hundred rings. All right, here we go. The good old Hundo. Because Knuckles is all about the Benjamins. Let's go, dude. I think we got like maybe two and a half minutes to get a hundred rings. Wow. You know, in some weird way, I'm going to miss Knuckles' stages. Because some of them have been kind of a, a slog to get through, but uh, other times it's just been great. They've been a lot more fun than we thought they'd be. <laughs> Especially when you add fuckery to it. Fuck Ittery, I like to call it. Fuck Ittery, yes. I'm down for that. Finding some of these ring boxes is a bit difficult. Because a lot of them are hiding, and a lot of the ones you do find are only five rings. Ugh. Ooh, what? What on earth was that? So Were you trying to readjust gravity? gravity? <laughs> Def Defy uh, gravity. Th there's there's a barrier around that tower, and I can't climb on it, and the spring oh. sent me towards that barrier, and the game freaked out. It's like, wait, wait, I'm supposed to climb that. <laughs> Not yet, buddy. Hold on. I think that there's, like, ring boxes around here somewhere, and, like, these containers or something. I'm just <laughs> trying to be fast here and be quick. I'm still blown away that we just high-fived a deity. <laughs> that was cool. High five. We played leapfrog with him. <laughs> I just think we we reenacted 2001 in that one instance. <laughs> we went farther than space and time. That was awesome. I love that reset. Keep your rings code. 
it is cool. It makes these 100 ring stages so much more bearable. I could just reset here and just keep getting that 20 ring. Yes. We need some legitimacy, thank you very much. You need a little bit of honesty. Right. <laughs> Except when you hit the meteor in the wrong direction, then you're like, well, fuck it, okay. It's This Let's Play is 70% cheating and fuckery, 20% <laughs> honesty, and 30% inaccurate math statistics. <laughs> and 110% fun! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Woo! Look at me go! Okay, here we go. So that adds up to like 140%, or 240%. <laughs> oh, so that means if you want if, that means if you want fun, you have to get a whole other Let's Play out of it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go watch somebody else. Why are you watching us? This sucks. <laughs> oh god, there's nothing in here. Knuckles, why? Ugh. Oh, here we go. Come on. Come on. Damn it! Go Seriously, nothing? Nothing in here either. All right, uh, plan B. Uh, I can only count to A. No! <laughs> plan B. B for... Oh, God! <laughs> now, upwards drill strikes. Don't see that a lot. Guys, <laughs> that was actually really cool. He made a new move. Knuckles, use your backwards upwards airstrike! You got it, Sonic. I call it my tense and soul. Oh no! Oh. This is Knuckles, and I'm <laughs> back. I'm put away for a while. You go get some butter and beat your herd. You ready? Oh man, that is the most like heart-destroying thing ever. That broke my spirit and my mind. Uh, <laughs> just one enemy <laughs> took away your ring. It wasn't an enemy. It was just a. It was an <laughs> RNG-based meteor. Hey, pass UDJ. This is future UDJ. Why don't you look a little closer? It was a press, you idiot. It was your own damn fault. Oh God, a minor inconvenience kicked the shit out of you. Uh, damn it. Now I'm thinking, there's gotta be another 20 ring box around here somewhere. But of course there fucking isn't. <laughs> there isn't! Of course oh there God. isn't! Why would there be? <laughs> it's nowhere to be found! <laughs> Come on! I think maybe I can get it over the. No. Oh. Uh. Alright, well. So when in doubt, go gravity. <laughs> Later, Earth! Ooh. I love how fast that goes when you drill claw and you go back up. That is nice. Love that speed. Just definitely gets get, it gets getting around here a lot easier. Mace. This, yeah, I think this is the best stage for it too because this is so vertical. I think it would have worked for Rouge's stage a lot too, for Mad Space. Well, I think just like permanently deleting that stage would have helped Rouge's stage. <laughs> yeah. That stage blows, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I don't care how we played it. That stage sucked. It it, it did, but it's, it's it's over now. So <laughs> the the bad level's gone now. You don't have to worry. The mad uh -oh. level's gone now. Uh oh, free falling. I'm just trying to get a good bird's eye view so I can maybe see a ring box here and there. But nope, nothing doing. Maybe Knuckles just likes the thrill of skydiving with no parachute or anything. Just the hope that gravity will work in his favor. Well, he ain't got much to do on Angel Island, so I guess he just kind of bungee jumps you know, for <laughs> That's fun. That's true. <laughs> He's hoping the Master Emerald will catch him just in case. I mean, he intentionally broke the Master Emerald because he wanted something to do. He's like, ah, I gotta get out of the house. Might as well just break this and look for the <laughs> Like, I think, I think that's what he does when he's bored. He just sits there like... <laughs> hmm. uh, I, got no I got nothing to do for at least a few more weeks. Boom! <laughs> Off I go! Oh, no! For the an island in the heavens, the blood of my assassins flows inside me! Actually, I'm just thinking he's he's going like, oh, sh should I call uh, should I call Sonic and Tails over here? I'm, I am kind of bored. Maybe they can, you know, come keep me company. Nah, fuck them. Master Emerald. Oh no. So, so Beauty with Sonic. 
weeks mm. of arduously finding my emerald shards. I do love my emerald. Well, <laughs> <laughs> he's using the master emerald like a magic eight ball. He's shaking it. It's like, should I break you? And the emerald gets into his head saying, yes, Knuckles, break me. Break me harder. Uh, come on, just four more rings. Can I four really find more just rings. four more somewhere? Four more Oh, one! Uh, one, uh, two, uh, three, uh, five! Mass statistics! We Yay! <laughs> we did it! Good job, Knucklehead! This is perfect. In 38 seconds, no less. Damn! I wish I had your time manipulation abilities. Me too. <laughs> this is Knuckles' power and Knuckles' power alone. Is this the stage you would like to go to? Alright, third stage. It's finding the Chow, and he's at the tippy top. So you know what okay. that means. And gravity's gone. Yep. yep. <laughs> oh. Up we go. <laughs> you glide right by him. Hey, Chow! <laughs> Well, just over here. The altar should be up here, I think. <laughs> do we even need it with this gravity-defying BS? We do. Oh, really? Because it works just like Mad Space's Lost Chow. Oh, okay. Uh, I really we, hope we are Knuckles. We play it. It brings it. We uh, try to hop into this. Try to hop into that portal. Ah, there we go. And it takes us to this enclosed area. Oh. We had like a minute for her to do this. I think so. There and, we go. Hey, there we go. I was really hoping there wasn't a situation where we had to like break something yeah. and it turns out we weren't knuckles. Holy shit! <laughs> Meteor out of nowhere! Well, that was terrifying anyway. <laughs> Use the chow as protection. No, knuckles! <laughs> Way to go, knucklehead! I have no idea why I made that chow sound like Toad, but whatever. Right, now for the, for the most easiest one, it's the time attack. we got to do it in four and a half minutes. Think we can do it? Might be a little track difficult, but okay, let's give it a shot. First thing you do is fuck it. I found him. And you had a hundred rings to spare. Yep. Really, these time attack stages are just a barrier to the actual yeah, fun stage. That is, is the hard mode. Hard mode. Spike balls in space. Oh, I just thought of something. Did you already test the uh, the ring cheat to see if it breaks the game? Which ring cheat? Like uh, having 999 rings. Yeah, it breaks I... it for the 100 rings. Okay, but it doesn't break it for any other part of the stages? Nope, that's it. Okay, because I was thinking, I just saw the, the amount of... Jesus Christ. Oh, all you right. lost all your 100 rings. Taking bets now. How many tries do you think it'll take to get this first emerald? Give you a, give you a hint, it's not one, because we gotta hit that boulder into it's that awesome. door. Oh, really? So yeah, that's attempt number one, take a bet. Alright. Go. Seven. Number two. Mm -hmm. Nope. Alright. Uh, how- Actually, let me change my bet to ten. Oh, almost. Ah, oh. no. Number four. Uh, maybe I should change my bet to fifteen. Um, I I'm not doubting your abilities. It's just this is this is hard. Ah, uh, three, four. Oh, four. Four. Don't doubt my abilities. Okay. Awesome. All right. I I'd like to uh, change my bet to four. Ah, I did it. This next one is a little bit hard to find. How hard is it? Because uh, there's one bit of geography, I guess, that I'm, or like one landmark that'll tell me how to get this next emerald, but it's finding that specific landmark that is a little tricky. And it's just one of these random platforms up here? It's... We gotta go to a random platform that has a ledge on the end of it, that has an extra life on it. Oh. 
We find that, and we'll get our next emerald. But finding that is tricky. Hmm. Is Somewhere. it blatantly obvious? Not really. Like, this isn't like, you know, a thing, you know, we'll find out just... Oh, there it was! <laughs> Silly this, me! This is a little cryptic. Just, 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 just a tiny skosh bit cr uh, cryptic. I'm keeping my eyes open for it. I haven't seen anything. Another thing I'm trying to do is seeing if I can't get a lock onto the emerald, because if I get a lock on the emerald, then I can probably retrace my steps and find the actual location as to where I need to go. But space is so big! It's not the tippy top. I kind of like how the emeralds are spread out in this stage. There's one towards the bottom, the second one is towards the middle, the last one's at the top. Hmm. That, I, I like that. That, that's, that fits really well. well Unlike they definitely... one mine, where it's like, alright, here at this ass end of the level, and then here at that ass end of the level. Well, they're, they want to make sure you enjoy this level, because this has definitely been a oh. trip. Oh. Okay. Got a lock on. Where are you at? We gotta oh, find the gone. right landmark, though. Hmm. It's over there. Mm. Almost. Hello, Blobby. Hmm. It's close. Where could it be? Oh, we've almost got it. <laughs> that meteor's having a time. It does involve the sunglasses, yes. Oh, really? That's why it's needlessly cryptic. And oh, that's not, so... that's not even half the challenge. And then you have to go through a bunch of fucking spike balls! Oh. Oh, aha! There uh, it is. Hey, look at that! This right here. It's by the star. It's by that hint. Jump on here. This ledge. There's an extra life for you. Don't fall off. That's bad. Oh, don't fall off. That's bad. Don't fall off. That is yeah, bad. Don't fall off. Okay. Then you go ahead and throw in your sunglasses. And there's spring. spring. Because, go? obviously. Oh, to that spring. Oh. What? And then, oh, uh, eh, there it is. Really? It's just out in space. Yep. Now we need to go to the tip top, tippy top, top, tip top. Now, wait. Do you, you have to use the sunglasses to find it? Or can you find that just regularly if you're flying around? Well, you have to use the sunglasses because that'll take you to the one screen you need to go, and then the other screen you need to go, and then by that point you need to very quickly and efficiently see if you can't glide over to that emerald with expert timing and precision. Well, I mean, like with you fucking around, would you be would you have been able to find that look just regularly? Probably yes. Okay. But it would have been hard because it's just one little tiny emerald in this vast blackness of space. <laughs> yeah. If I have the if the I have springs to guide me, it's easier to find. Okay. Because that's very similar as to how this third emerald works, too. Oh. You gotta use the sunglasses, you gotta hit a spring, you gotta... You gotta do the thing. I still think the sunglasses are really stupid. Really? Because you just use them once to find a spring to take you somewhere else. Well, now we're using them twice to find another spring. <laughs> See? Stupid. <laughs> Now, follow me here. What we're looking for is a moon. A moon. Okay. See, a moon. There's a moon. As we go to the moon, we use the sunglasses, and, of course, nothing happens. Uh... Alright. Naturally. <laughs> yeah, because nothing happens when you go to the moon. Exactly. So that's incorrect. It's the wrong moon. Go find another one. It is the wrong moon. Turns out there's a second layer of, uh, like this is the top layer of platforms, there's a second layer of ledges down here. Oh! I do believe I just got attacked. No, Knuckles yeah. just he shrugged it off, that's what he does. All right. This is the moon we need, because that has a spring that takes us forward. Ooh. And there it wow. is. Wow. Okay. Like Sarama, tell you what. Oh, congrats! We did it! Thanks! Thanks! We did it! Or you did it, I was yeah, just sitting here talking to myself. Perfect. Well, that's what we're both doing. <laughs> right. So 150! 151! Oh, that's right! Because... Well done. Yay! 
Didn't Knuckles. think we'd get this far. Well done. Knuckles Kart Race. Hey, congratulations! Well done. <laughs> How exciting. Have more shit. Yes. But no, dear viewer. Our time is not yet done. What? Because we got a new code. Oh, of course. You know what that means, right? <laughs> Fuck him up! Look at all those A's. We're going to City Escape again! As Knuckles? Nope. Oh. As Sonic. <laughs> As the test room? As... Gravity huh? Control. Oh! <laughs> Boing. There's the gravity down. And then I put the gravity up. <laughs> he just kind of does this. <laughs> moves very slowly. Oh, lord. Let's see if I can't <laughs> maybe try and get him out of here. Holy crap. Do you think Sonic would survive in a hyperbolic time chamber? Sure. With the gravity all the way up? Yeah. <laughs> He'll just turn into a ball. I, well, okay. Oh, of course, gravity God. will uh, reflect off of his uh, the curvature of his, of his body. Look how so, many widows you're making. Oh, now okay. the journey begins. Whoa! <laughs> oh, no! The gravity's too high. You fell through the platform. And we still got our uh, part of yeah, the wing, I guess. Our, our little surfboard. Uh, let's see. I want to get back to where the level is, but I don't want to get Look too... Look at oh, that uh, city. There oh. we go. Whoa. Is, that the, is that the end? No, that's the beginning. It's progress. We're going further. I'm trying to make sure that I don't get caught in the uh, invisible wall, though. Right. So, eventually, by the end of this Let's Play, we're going to completely fuck up City Escape and beat it. Is that the goal here? Well, let's see how far we get with this. Doing pretty good. All right, so that's oh. another, that's another uh, roadblock I was worried about, that uh, going down the building thing. Yeah. Yeah. Which but, means... Uh, now, um, we're here. <gasps> oh, this is the end! It... Wait. Is this the beginning again? Shouldn't there be something here that's not here? The truck is gone! The truck isn't here because it you didn't see us. You never triggered it! We went right over their heads. They didn't see us at all. The government ain't gonna catch me today. And the camera is a little unsure of what to do here now. <laughs> is it the cutscene? Is it not? What do we do here? Sega, help! And? and... Oh! And now for wow. the most difficult challenge. <laughs> all the years of fighting Eggman. Not, not difficult. Trying to go into the goal ring. Fucking impossible. Trying, yeah. Oh shit! Trying to go up to get the <laughs> ring. Come on. Come on. Go! Get oh. it? Yeah! There we go. All right. <laughs> you know the way, he, <laughs> way he's standing on that? That board should be coming up and smacking the back of his head. I just want to see it. Oh, look, and you got an A rank. To go, oh, go figure. Oh. All right, let's uh, do a little more experimentating okay. with this gravity code. Again, let's try a car level, see what happens. Oh, dear lord. I'm up Sorry, nothing, Buster. Aw, nothing really? Nothing. Doesn't work like that. That's kind of bold. I was disappointed too, I wanted a flying car so bad. <laughs> Is this the there she goes. Like to go to? Yeah. Where else can we go? Mm, oh, Death Chamber. I forgot that was called that. Eh, let's go to the child world. Okay. Maybe we can With do the some gravity. Alright. I'm still trying to beef up Deji May and Shithy a lot. Still trying to take okay. him to school. That's gonna, that's gonna take a good while. Guaranteed. <laughs> really, there's nothing much fun left to do. We haven't been here in a while. That's just because you're buffing him up. I mean, gravity control doesn't really do anything fun, really. Mm -hmm. Like I thought it would. Pick up a chow and do it. Yes. Deji May's got 26, 26, oh. 24, 26, so that's doing good, too. Damn. 
And I'll be beefing him up for the next little while, so, uh, we'll just see you next time on Let's Play Sonic Adventure 2, and we'll see how strong Digimon can really get. Nice, and then we'll go off to the races. Uh, m maybe later, but... Maybe. Oh, well, eventually. That's coming later. We'll see you next time on Let's Play Sonic Adventure 2, bye! Hi-hi! Bye! <laughs>